Hello everyone. Well, I never expected my first actual astro vlog published to come from my so sad for astronomy backyard, but here we are. Um, first of all, I should clarify the title. No, I did not discover an asteroid. We knew about this one already. I simply found it or located it in the night sky. Now, what happened was I was in the online discussions with some of my astronomy students this past weekend, and I was responding to a post about asteroids. It reminded me of an article that I read in this month's Sky and Telescope magazine, talking about the asteroid Vesta. Vesta is the second largest asteroid in the main asteroid belt here in our solar system, but it is the brightest out of all of the asteroids in the main belt. It's going to reach opposition on December 21st of this year. Uh, opposition is when it's at its best for viewing for the year. It's going to get up to about magnitude 6.4. That is not a naked eye object, except for some experienced viewers under the absolute most pristine conditions and, you know, just beautiful night skies. Most of us are going to need binoculars or a telescope. My students don't typically have that. But then I realized, wait, they do have cameras on their phones. I wonder if you could capture and locate the asteroid using a smartphone picture. So I took my iPhone 14 and I took my El Cheapo, like 10 year old Walmart tripod outside. I set the camera up on the tripod. I pointed it to the region of the sky between Orion and Gemini, because that's where Vesta is passing through on this particular occasion. I set it for a 30 second exposure and then went in and analyzed, or well, I looked as closely as I could at the image. Basically what you do is you open up your picture and you open up either a Starfinder chart or I like to use Sky Safari. So I had those two things, I was going back and forth between the two windows and you look for stars that match up. So for example, here is Betelgeuse in the image and I can find it on the map. I zoom in a little bit more and now you start lining up all of the different clusters of stars and matching what you have in your image with what's going on on the star charts. And you just keep narrowing it down until finally I found Vesta. Um, of course, the only way to really know for absolute certain that you found an asteroid is to go back and image it again, take another photo the next night and see if that asteroid has changed. Lo and behold, I went out the next couple of nights and you can blink back and forth between the two images and you can clearly see the object moving. That's Vesta. So yeah, I found an asteroid with my phone. This was a really easy astronomy project. Again, just a, a cheap tripod and the camera on my phone. Go ahead and give this a try for yourself. Use a Starfinder or uh, an app like Sky Safari to help you know where to look and to help you when you're zooming in to actually pinpoint Vesta in your images. But give it a shot and see how it goes. I've got other astro vlogs coming up here soon. Actually, things that I did uh, over a month ago even that I just have to, to get through and finish the video on. So please subscribe and follow along with some of my adventures and misadventures under the night sky.